My name is Chris. I am a third year, going into my fourth year, um, forensic PhD clinical student. We're here in Fresno at Alliant University. I'm originally from Washington State, and I found that coming to this campus in Fresno was incredibly different, um, obviously, than where I'm naturally from. But our cohort really bonded pretty well right from the from the get-go I would say because we all took the same classes and we were integrated in a lot of the same practicum sites from the beginning so we formed some pretty strong relationships. My first practicum I was set out to a school district where I worked at the um, elementary, middle, and high school and because I'm forensic emphasis well, forensic field. Um, I specifically asked for the most derelict children, if you will, and I was provided with just such those children, which was really interesting. I'd never worked with children before, and they were extraordinarily challenging. They were in and out of the juvenile justice system and had a lot of problems at home and in school academically. So that was really great for developing my own clinical skills with kids from a wide variety of ages. ages. And uh, then my second year practicum, I worked at the public defender's office. I wrote psychological evaluations for the public defender. So I would go in, uh, sit with their clients in jail or juvenile hall, interview the client, um, give them any type of assessments that I thought were necessary, whether it was risk assessment or substance abuse, um, personality disorders, that sort of thing. And then write a report with my treatment recommendations, provide it to the attorney who would then provide it to the judge. And that report would be integrated into the uh, recommendations for in, while in trial. And that was by far the most amazing practicum site that I've ever had. If I could ideally do that for the rest of my life, I would. Oh, and my family thinks it's amazing. Um, there's actually nobody in my family that's in the social social sciences field, so we just have to distinguish between CSI and actual forensic psychology. <laughs> A lot of people they get that mixed up, but other than that, they're very proud, and they're they're wanting to see me on TV one day.